I've made a mistake, haven't I, chat? I've made a big mistake, haven't I? I thought, like, you know, it's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. We're just gonna go into this, and it, it, it just be, it's just gonna be, it, yeah, it, oh, yeah. You know, I, 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 I have a lot of willpower. I have a lot of reserve, you know. Yeah, yeah. But, but, it, you know, but, uh. Fine, fine, fine. I, 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 I will not give in. I will not give in. Uh, we will kill them with fire. We will bring fire and death and hell upon them all. Upon all of them. Ah! We'll make this their hell today. Come on, the microphone. Bend to my will. We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Hi. Hello, everybody. <laughs> so, 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 to, to, to bring this up in context, to bring this up in context, and no, I'm not stalling. I played The Witcher 3, right? Great game. Great game. Really enjoyed the story aspects of it, and every once in a while I'd be like, okay, now I'm going to break off the pacing from the story stuff, and I'm going to do, like, bounty missions, and every once in a while, you know, head towards one of the little skulls on the map and be like, oh, okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. We're going to go into this cave. It's going to be fine. We're going to kill some, you know, you know, you know half dog man abomination thing. But no, no, it was just your basic ass spider colony crew, whatever. There'd be like six of them. They just kind of, you know, skitter their way out. And I just, nope, scream my way out of the cave. No, now <laughs> we're going into Dark Souls 2. This is an older game than The Witcher 3. But 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 this is also a from software game, which means it's going to be somewhat scary. Probably. Ah, it, the spiders are so much worse in this game. Damn it, Tropical Pigeon. <laughs> I was trying to psych myself up. I was trying to psych myself up. Given the way that mobs have been like clumped in this game, I'm half expecting there's going to be a point where we're going to be surrounded <laughs> by like by like five spiders at once. Since this is an exceptional situation, I'll just give you a tip. Use torches and the spiders become trivial. Might make your experience easier. Really? All right, here's how we can do this. We can do a little divination here. If he says his name in the first uh, bit of uh, dialogue here, the spiders are going to be a lot bigger. Come to see our Damn it! Damn it! <laughs> Shit! Shit! Ugh. We need endurance. We need mental endurance. That is literally the, wait, no, no, no. We need help, help, help. <laughs> oh no, I'm dying. I'm actually dying. Ooh. But if that might help you, come to me. I have come. Oh, they have battle piggies. Check that out. Ah, no, oh, okay, good, I died. I died. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 I'm not ready. I'm not ready. <laughs> oh, no. No. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh, that's right. That's right. We'll be right back. My senses are honed. I'm opening a door with two spiders on it. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Okay. Oh no, no. I swear to God, once I exit this tunnel, they're just going to be everywhere, aren't they? <sighs> ah! Shit! Ah! Oh! Oh, that looked really realistic! Oh! Oh! Oh, that... Oh, it was just hanging! 
being there. <laughs> I'm going to shut my eyes. I'm going to shut my eyes. No, I can't. I can't. I can do this. I can do this. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's nothing. I can't even lock onto it. Yep. Mm-hmm. It's nothing. I can't even lock onto it. It's a dead one. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. 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 Mm-hmm. 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 Fuck. Fuck. That's it. No. Oh! Mm. Oh! <sighs> Where am I going once I get in here? Where am I going once I get in here? Where am I going once I get in here? To the right? To the right? Yeah. Yeah. To the right. To the right. Shit. Fuck. Okay. Going to the left. Going to the left. Why are there all these holes? Why are there all these holes? Okay, so you guys want the lore? You guys want to know why I'm so scared of spiders? You know? You want to know? I can't do it while I'm looking at that one. Okay, okay. You want to know why? You want to know why? So, when I was around nine years old, no, no, I was older. Ten, ten. I went to a camp. I went to a camp, and the spiders uh, wasn't something that I was actually afraid of at that time. I, I think I just disliked them. But I was playing Capture the Flag, as you do, with like a lot of kids and stuff. And my thought, as always, is I am a loner and I'm going to go off and I'm going to flank and get the flag. I'm going to run out of bounds entirely, come all the way back around the forest, come all the way in to this big, like, band concert style stage area that the flag was behind facing the wall of the back of it. So, you know, you've got this big kind of platform thing with wall there, flag is, you know, on that spot there, and then there's a bunch of a grass area that comes around it, but the forest is like 20 feet from the back of the stage, basically. And they only had one person guarding there, because that was the rule, if you're gonna puppy guard, you can only have one person there. So my thought was I'm gonna go all the way around the forest and come around the backside and just jump in, grab it, and disappear into the forest because I'm quick and I'm small. I get really close, I get really close, right? But as I'm creeping and stuff, I start making noise. And one of the people goes, oh, there's someone in there. I can't tell who it is. They send one of the big kids after me, someone like 13 or 14 years old. I panic because I'm in their area. I run back to get away. They didn't know where I was, though, and they didn't want to see me as a distraction and avoid like guarding the flag. Um, so basically, they had someone that was guarding the guard the flag and the other person that was a runner that would chase people if they guard the flag. Well, I ran and I stepped into... A hole. The hole... <sighs> the hole was grass growth and stuff that was just there. I stepped into it, my knee went down, and my hands went out to guard myself, right? To basically be like, oh, I'm gonna fall down, that's okay. I... Hands go down, and the ground just kind of goes... Whoa, whoa. The whole area, the whole area that I landed in was basically a massive web grass like woven area of spiders. The nest erupts and a whole bunch of them just crawl over my legs. Well, I just absolutely know that I can, you know, not really die from spider bites, but they can bite and it's gonna swell up, it's gonna hurt. And I run, I run, I'm screaming and making all kinds of noise. That's not the worst part about it, guys. That's not the worst part about it. For the next two days, I was finding spiders on me. Just finding them. They'd be just in my armpit. Just chilling there. Ah! Like, 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 you, you don't know what that's like to be asleep and to feel it crawling on your stomach. And you're like, I thought I got all of them. Ah! Ah! So that's, that's the first story. Stick around if you want to hear stories two and three. It gets worse. It gets worse. Ah! I hate you, spiders. I hate you. See? See? See, spiders? Just channel the dark side. Yeah, just go. Just go. Why? Why is there no way through here? They didn't do anything. Fuck. Balls. Shit. Fuck. They're everywhere. Ah! Oh, I can hear them now. I can hear them now. Oh, and they put a chest there to bait me. They put a chest there. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We have a bow. We have a bow. Oh, oh, like the sconce. You're, thank you. Thank you, Chad. Oh, 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 thank you.
you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Wait, if I use a bow, I have to two hand, then I have to get rid of my torch. Shit. We just skip the spiders, right? We just skip them. We just run. And I'm guessing if we run underneath them, it'll trigger. Uh... <laughs> you know what? I'm going to use the power of concentration. Oh, oh, oh my God. Just my hair itching now freaks me out. Okay, I swear to God, if any of them come behind me, that's going to be the most trolly bullshit. I am going to focus on the image of the spider in my mind. I'm going to burn it into my brain until I'm not scared of that image of spider. And as long as there's no other types of spiders, I should be fine. I haven't seen the move yet, but I'm looking at it. It's not moving, it's just there. It's just a JPEG. It's just a JPEG. It's not even like doing like a breathing, like kind of resting animation thing. Oh, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. This is like Kung Fu Panda imagining that the scroll, the dragon scroll, is a fucking cook, is a fucking cookie. You know, I'm just like, mm, mm, like, ah, ah, ah. okay, pathway. Boom, straight through. Wait, actually, hold on. Could I just hug the left wall? Nope, I don't trust that. Yep, oh shit, that is, a, that is an active spider right there. That is an active spider leg. Oh, that's another one. Why did I look in the holes? I should have just believed. We run, right? We absolutely run. Panic, run, 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 run. Oh, 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 oh. I'm just delaying the inevitable. I'm just delaying the inevitable. <laughs> Fuck the chest. I don't care about a chest. Okay. Okay. You, you, you son of a bitch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna lingering flame your ass. I'm gonna lingering flame your ass. You are not even gonna know what hit you. You're not even gonna know what hit you. Why can't I lock onto it? Why can't I lock onto it? Ah! Ah, there's another one above the door. I, I just know there is. Jump! Jump! Yeah, get fucked. Let that be the only one in there. I do not want to look up and just see one directly behind me. That is like the worst. Don't, don't. Come on, let me abuse the camera. Let me abuse the camera. Come on, come on. Don't, don't do that. Don't do that. This is the spider boss? Okay, chat, I don't care about spoilers. Tell me, is this the spider boss? Come on, please. <laughs> no, it's not. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I can't look, I can't look, I can't look. I can't look, I, I actually can't look. Cause it's gonna lock me into the animation. Oh, oh, oh shit, it's a different boss, okay. Uh, okay. Oh my god, this boss is weak. This boss is so weak. Holy shit. This is like... This boss is so weak. Holy shit, if this game like... Gives me like... Like newfound courage with regards to spiders... This will be like one of the most momentous occasions of my life. <laughs> I see you, I see you. I see you, some clever camera manipulation. You can't hide from me. So I will use elevation and camera manipulation. Ha ha, you fool.
was fine. We're just gonna breathe for a second. We're just gonna, we're just gonna process that. Oh. <sighs> this room is a trap. I can just tell. You die! You die! Come at me! Come at me! Come at me! You jumping sons of bitches! I kill you all! I exterminate your families! Kill you all! Ah! Ew, the body's twitching. Come on! If it's dead, let it die! Oh. Oh! Oh no! No! No, please let that not be like the boss or something like it. Like the boss is just a big person that's been. Oh no. No, 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 no. No! That one seems to know the way. Oh no, we have to walk on the webbing? <sighs> Guys, we did this. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Patience, Caleb, patience, patience. I'm gonna look this big, ugly, ugly, nasty, little, you know, just right in its eyes. I'm gonna be like, you are gonna burn. You're gonna burn. You're gonna burn. Oh, all right. Okay, of course they have to play a cinematic. I can look at you guys now. I can look at you guys now. Oh, God. Yep, roar in my face. Yep, yep, roar in my face. I can tell. Yep, yep, yep. Did it turn off my torch? I s just, just, just. Wait, oh, God. Its armor is... Its armor is too hard. Oh, I have to hit it directly in the eyes. Okay, okay, that's fine. It's just an ugly, it's just an ugly moving fortress. That's all, that's all. The damage though, the damage. I'm not even looking at its legs. Holy shit, it jumped. Holy shit, it jumped. Oh, that's its anus. God damn. Perfect execution. <sighs> Die! First try! Run, you little shits! Run! Your mother is dead! I killed her! Let all who let all who see me fear the name Spider Slayer! Be gone! Be gone! <laughs> oh my god, look at this head. This is my head. We kick it around like a soccer ball now. <laughs> ah, <laughs> yeah. Woo! I did it! I did it! <laughs> What the f Oh my god. Oh my god. Ah. Oh, we're back. And we never ever 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 have to go there again. Ah. Oh, I'm just going to let her talk to me just to listen to her voice. You are blessed with a myriad of souls. Yes, I am. Okay, the spider story. Yeah, so 
The other spider story was I went to go do some gardening for my grandma. Uh, some of my cousins were going to help me, and we basically decided, okay, we'll split up the work. You cover this area, you cover this area, and we need to tear out a whole ton of weeds, right? So we end up basically covering this patch of dirt that is like just riddled with roots and nasty weeds and vines and shit and we get big shovels and we're like all right let's just dig the whole thing out and then we'll refill it in with new dirt afterwards works hard we go and do this for like an hour an hour then we start moving to new area do the same thing rinse repeat on the third area my shovel gives when it goes down like, it goes down, and there's that initial resistance, and then there's that spot where it goes, whoom, and it goes down. And I'm confused, but I'm like, oh, that's going to make this a little bit easier, right? Because, oh, no no big deal. I guess, I guess if anything, the, the ground underneath is kind of soft. Plot twist, there was no ground underneath a certain part. I don't know how I find them, chat. I don't know how I find them. But... I took my shovel, did the little, like, you know, pull it back so it, like, unearths it, and it, like, you know, kind of dis it displaces the dirt. I then take my step, my, uh, my foot, step on the, uh, you know, step on the shovel's uh, bit there, and push it up. And once I do, they just, just, poof, there's this just gap of nothing underneath it, and little brown spiders just... Boof, just go up my leg, go everywhere. Like, hundreds of them. Now, these spiders are tiny. Oh, okay, so take your take your index finger and take from your first knuckle to your second knuckle. That's the size of the spider's diameter. So these ones are, are pretty tiny. But the thing is, is that my brain immediately went to pure survival mode because I remember that in Washington, there is a brown spider that is that size that is very dangerous. Now, I was wrong in that it wasn't the brown recluse, but I thought it was the brown recluse. I thought I was going to die. So, of course, immediately strip naked, throw off all my clothes, scream for everyone else to get away, get away, spiders. And I'm just screaming, you know, manic and stuff like that my grandma is such a badass and thinks so like on the fly she goes runs over turns on her hose right picks it up and she says caleb come over here and i'm like yeah and then she sprays me down well i'm buck ass naked and she just hoses me down she's hosing off spiders one of them, like, holds on, and he's, like, this close from my ball sack. Like, this close from my junk. Like, my entire career is about to be over. This guy is right here, like, on the bottom of my leg. And I turn around and, you know, spread ass cheeks, you know, clear. I'm like, get it, get it! And she's just like, calm down. She, like, gets up really close and, like, sprays that one specifically off. Oh! And I was fine. And I was fine. Now, I had been bitten like four times, right? So, that in and of itself caused enough trauma right there. But I had... Oh, I had already at this point experienced the... Oh, let's actually... Let's, let's remember how old was I at this point. 19. So this has been a good 10 years. Like, maybe like... Maybe I was 18. But I, I was an adult. Grown... Grown... <laughs> grown ass man and stuff like that but um uh it had been a while since i'd had a spider's nest kind of moment there old dragon slayer oh oh shit it's um it's ornstein we killed you he's not using lightning attacks though oh he doesn't have smell
Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Bye bye. Good fight. Final story is that I was in this one city where there was a glass bridge. I got to hang out with some of my friends. I think there were five of us in total. We went up to this bridge that has a nice, like, kind of artistic kind of structure on the top of it. And while there, we're thinking like, oh, okay, this is nice. It's lit up during the night. You know, it's cool, it's cool. Um, but we should go underneath it to see what it's like with the river and everything. So we went underneath it, put our hands in the river. It was cold, it was nice. My buddy, not as much a friend really anymore, thought it'd be funny, show me the underside of the bridge. We looked up at the underside of the bridge and I was like, huh, a whole bunch of gunk underneath the bridge. I don't know what it is, but suddenly this guy who's got a good, like, think 60, 70 pounds on me, bigger guy, like six foot four, probably about 250 pounds or so, picks me up by my legs and hoists me up onto, onto his shoulders. And I'm like, I'm like, Haha, what are you doing, man? And he's like, oh, nothing. I just wanted to uh, show you something. And then he like hoists me up even more. It's where I'm like having trouble balancing, right? And I'm underneath the bridge and my eyes like adjust because it's lit up, but it's also dark. I, it's hard to be able to see exactly what it is that makes the uh, underside of this glass bridge look so dirty. And it wasn't that it looked dirty. It looked almost kind of cloudy. And there's this white shit underneath the glass bridge. What do you think that white shit was? Yeah. Exactly. A big just cloud of spider webs. Spider webs running all the way underneath this glass bridge. Massive, massive glass bridge. And yet I'm thinking... That's fine. That's fine. There's a big bridge up above me. And we're talking like, it's a good 20, 25 feet from my head still. But then my eyes adjusted again. And I realized that hanging from a bunch of threads all down the bridge were spiders hanging from the threads. And the ones that were near me were descending quickly. And these spiders were about eight feet from my face. And they were like coming down in like, like by like 50 or 60 or so. I'm gonna be exaggerating the numbers probably because my head, I was terrified. But I said twice, yo, put me down. Yo, put me down, this is not cool. And he laughed. And the lack of a yes or a no Triggered the monkey brain, the animal brain that wants to live. And the fact that he said nothing but laughed gave me the idea that he did not care about my, my panic in that moment. So uh, I'm not proud of this. I'm not proud of this. Yes, he knew about my spider phobia. Yeah, yeah, he did. That's why he thought it was funny. I'm not going to say what the other people around me did, because some of them were like, yo, put him down, it's not cool. I think what they didn't expect was that I couldn't move. Like, I couldn't I couldn't get out from, an, from his grasp there, but I could move my upper body, right? But you know, in a video game, when a character does a finishing move, and they jump on the bigger character and does like a, like a, ah, you know, like they do something for the neck or the, the face or something like that. Yeah, I, uh, I, uh, I basically just did this and pulled <laughs> until he let me go. And he freaked out because he did not think it was that serious, even though he knew, you know, I have pretty bad phobia about it. But the panic set in to the point where I literally, like, did the whole thing where you grab the top, you grab the lip and you, like, yank it. And then my other two fingers went for his eye. And, yeah. He, he he was really angry after that, but he was also, like, getting told off by his friends for, like, dude, you, like, you, you deserved that. 
No, no, no. He, he, he was angry just because it hurt. Like, like I, I really could have like really hurt his eye. Like it's that, it's that, it's that level of escalation where if I basically like punched him in the face, he would have been like, okay, I get it. But instead of punching him in the face, I went for his eye, which is like a, that's like, you know, that, yeah, I kind of, I kind of, you know, potentially threatened his future there. Yeah, that's, that's the final spider trauma story. Nice. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Here we go.